So he's covering the Japanese flag. History repeats itself, as they say. I just came to run, coach. I just came to run. Tigo shippo. So today's movie is called 1947 Boston. 1947 Boston? I saw the trailer for that one. That looks really good. Oh yeah, why? 1947 Boston is based on true events from a very important time in Korean history. Oh yeah, I'm also very interested. Well, let's see what this movie is all about. Yeah. 베를린의 영광이 조선인의 손기정의 영광이야? 일본인 손기태의 영광이야. 그건 절대로 지워지지 않아. 선생님 유니폼에 일장기 달릴 거 모르고 뛰셨어요? 우리가 1945년대 해방했으니까요. 혼란스러운 그 시기에 꿈을 실현시키려고 노력했던 사람들의 얘기이기 때문에 이 힘이 어마어마하구나 자부심이 생긴다 Sonkijong, that's a name I've heard before. You probably have. Now, I don't know if you know this, but I'm a bit of a history nerd myself, so I'm quite familiar with Sonkijong. And Sonkijong, he won the gold medal in the 1936 Olympics, right, as we say. But the big episode that happened, the big scandal, was that the next day in the Korean newspapers, the newspapers removed the Japanese flag from the pictures of Sonkijong. And the movie we're going to see today is a story that happened 11 years later, two years after the liberation of Korea, with a new marathoner uh, in Boston. So we're going to see a bit more about that story and how it continues the story from 1936. That is crazy. That's so interesting. All right, well, it must have been some crazy period. So let's check out some of those highlights. <laughs> Uh, look at this. So he's covering the Japanese flag with the, with the flowers. Some famous actors in this movie. So we have Seo Yun Buk and Song Gi Jung. Right, right, are right. Are the two primary athletes we're looking at. Right. John Kelly한테서 답장이 왔어요. It's thanks to you that you asked John Kelly. Boston 대회 참가할 수 있는 초청장입니다. 남 선배가 좋아하겠습니다. 감사합니다. Congratulations, but there is one condition. All right, so now they're talking about the Boston Marathon. Right. Finally, the title of the movie makes I sense. I know, 1947 Boston, <laughs> just like that. 달리면 누가 돈준 댔어? 아니요. 이거 돈도 안 되는데 밥 먹고 살 기술이나 배우지 뭐 하러 왔어요? 저는 뛰는 거 원래 좀 뛰고 싶어 뛰고 싶어서 왔어요. 잠깐만 기다려봐. 응. 아저 그냥 이거 신고 뛸게요. 진아이 새끼야. 고맙습니다. I just came to run, coach. Just came to run. 뛰고 싶어. Look at his shoes. Oh. Now, I have received final confirmation from the authorities that such a compromise is not possible. And accept that the Boston trip is not possible. I wish you better luck 
at the London Olympics next year. Why do we have to go to the country? Don't go to the country! Don't go to the country! If we have to go to the country, we'll have to go to the country! Oh yeah, that's cool. Okay, so the, the people, the people will come and help. Mm. Mm. Welcome to Boston. Good luck. Thank you. United States Military Government in Korea. This is the name of the United and now the Boston Marathon runners are not going to be able to wear the Korean flag once again. History repeats itself, as they say. I, uh, I really like this one simply for the historical context. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's obviously a really kind of powerful, uh, meaningful time in the history of Korea, especially when uh, you know, modern Korea was just becoming a nation, an independent nation. So it's really interesting to kind of see a specific story um, from that time. Tenacity. That's what both of these athletes are all about. Liberty. Not only because of it's the liberty of the nation, but it's the personal liberty to choose whether or not they want to run. <laughs> 